Hey guys, it's the uh, day of the live. It's the uh, 4th of February. It's snowing, but it's minus 7 out. It's coming down pretty good. But I ain't wasting a minus 7 day after having to go out in those really frigid days. I never filmed anything. It was just a race is all it was. If something was caught and I just undid it and left the ram, I didn't even fix them up again. So we got another... Uh, her third sick dog of the year, so. But it is beautiful out, we're gonna go north and we're gonna see what happens today. I'm kinda hurrying because I wanna get to town before uh, the live too, so forgive me if I'm a few minutes late for that. But, I'm gonna get the rest of my gear on. I'm thinking that I'm gonna go without the vest today because it's so nice out. Who knows what it's like at 40 miles an hour. I guess it's better to be warm than than get cold out there. So, so we're going to go with warm. I'll see you guys out there. Well, I just spent, oh, I don't know, an extra five miles driving around the countryside here because I didn't know where I was. She's pretty much a whiteout in the open and with the sled, I got to go slow because I can't see any depth in the snow. And you're up and down or... For the most part, though, it's pretty smooth. We're at the first one here. And looks like we got a dog. Okay. Well, he is very nicely furred. But as you can imagine, in that frigid cold we had, around minus 40 for the last 10 days, he's frozen. We'll go check the second one, and I close this one off. I think I got enough dogs this year. I'm going to close the north line off and just run the south. All right. So when we caught one at last time at Lindsay's, it looks like it hit again. I don't know. Maybe uh, I'm picking a bad day to pick these ones up, but... Oh, that's a nice looking dog. Oh, yeah. He'll do. You don't look like you're too heavy either to drag back. Like I said, I'm just, uh, the last one out at the cow bush there, I just relocked it and took the snare, took the wire so there's no tripping hazards there for anything. <laughs> It was actually, the loop was the third bull and Fox were walking through it. And I do not want to catch Fox. So, had a pretty good trail through there. So, yeah, I'm just going to pop him out of here. We still got one over there. We'll go close it off too. All right. Wow, three rams, two dogs. Well, I walked that other dog out. He's bigger than he looks. Oh, what we got? Looks like we're three for four rounds today. Oh man, that is killer. Take a rest. Another good looking dog. They sure are hard on themselves. You never sprung that ram either, so I'll just oh. put the safety back on, stand it over there, and abandon it till I can get it walk in here without oh this snow's terrible and dragging a dog out's even worse. But we won't have to worry about it after today. Just the south line. Tuesday, I talked to a gentleman, uh, asked me if I wanted some help skinning my dogs, and we worked out a deal, and he's going to skin some of my dogs. I'm going to do all the ones that I'm going to uh, sell to the subscribers, but he's going to do a lot of them that I uh, otherwise don't have time for. Or... But I'm going to get this done up and get going south we probably got a couple there too i'd hope all right let's keep moving forward 
Paul, we're four rounds in. Should we go see what the other one's got? When up is down and down is up. Sure hard seeing anything out here today. All right, we're at the second one at the gray bush. I don't see the ram. Okay. Kicked by the deer. Same as the last one, except I walked in here and I'm going to fix this one. I didn't fix the last one. Because we were in a hurry, like I said, to get to town. So I'm going to fix this one up really quick. Snare's good still. And we'll get on to that third one and then over the crown. Uh, I can't find them in here. There are many, many deer out there, though. I'm not letting him in the bush. I think I'm on him now, but I'm not sure. But yeah, that whole side over there was deer. A bunch of them ran when I uh, stopped, but they don't want to go back in the bush. Well, we're in the crown at this middle snare. I just saw a raven fly up over there. That's hope he's not on something I caught. But there's the fifth dog at this one. Like I said, I'm not gonna make him up. I gotta hurry today. But we got like seven days of single digit minus weather. Even though it's snowing, it's gonna be a lot nicer setting setting them up on uh these days than it was the last ten, so Oh, there's a squirrel way out there. You won't be able to see him. But I'm going to uh, check this dog out. Wow, well, while you're here, let's go check him out. Catching some pretty nice little dogs, so. Oh, I like a brick. That's what happens at minus 40. Looks beautiful. Looks beautiful. We're going to... Get them out of here and keep moving forward. We gotta hurry, guys. I'm uh, sorry for rushing you, but. Well, we're at our last snare at uh, Patrick's here. And it went bang too. Kind of fitting for a snare, last snare too. A few of them in between. What would you expect other than a beautiful dog? Oh, he's got hair coming off of him. Ah, those damn birds picked a hole in him. Well, he's garbage. That is the first one I've had eaten this year. Oh, well. Still, a four is not a bad day. Well, five, but one was eaten, so we're going to get him on the sled, drop him in the pit on the way in, and get to town. Well, that's too bad. He's a pretty nice dog. A little bit of a red belly compared to my other dogs, but oh well. He's pit bound. What a day. Not a lot of wind, but it's swirling, so the snow's coming from different directions at different times, so. I notice they're still in that, that deer hole over there, too. So, deer hole, whatever. Can't believe they tore this dog apart with that right there, but that happens. He was probably fresh when they tore into him, so. All right, let's go home. Oh, well, I showed you guys what's in the bush. That's why all of this. Oh, we got another clump up there waiting for this clump. 
and they don't care if they're running in front of me or not. You're gonna cross right in front of me. I know your guys' game plan already. I'm having a hard time getting through that deep snow though. Well guys, that's it, our trip to town and everything done. It's quite a day, I'm pretty beat, but I'm gonna have pizza already getting ready for the live tonight. Hope to see all a lot of you there. Uh, I don't really know what else to say except that I've decided to uh, tan 25 coyotes and offer them for 200 a piece shipping and everything because I got to ship them to get them tanned too so so I hear a lot of people from YouTube managers say you guys don't watch my videos to the end so I throw this right at the end for all the guys that do you want a fur put it in the comment please have a great weekend I guess and like I say we'll see you at the live